well, well. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. S say hi to all the YouTube people. Hi, guys. Go, go play. Hey, hey, don't bite him. Anyway. Um, good morning. It's a snowy, snowy morning in North Carolina. Um, this is supposed to be over by two o'clock, I hope. It's very windy and, uh, the boys are just fine. Dogs are having fun. They love this stuff. So, but, uh, it's windy here for me and I was going to put their blankets on last night, but Jack kept pulling his off. So right here, there's no wind at all. And look, Jack has got a nice blanket. I know he just shook it off. Hi, Jarvis. He's got a nice blanket of snow, a little bit of a little bit of wet. But um, I know, don't don't get all angry with him. It's not his fault. I've got food for you. I know. But they've got a, a blanket of snow on them, which is keeping their coats warm. Um, Jack had a thicker one, but it just fell off just a little bit ago. Hi, Jarvis, and your your whiskers. Good morning. Good mornings. And uh, Jack, good morning. I know. You think Jarvis is going to pop you, huh? But that nice snow and the ice that's accumulating on his fur is keeping him warm. It's showing me that he's not cold. Because um, if it if he was losing heat, it would be melting. Yeah, I know. You're a good boy. I know my hands probably taste yucky. I put a, a whole bale of hay, half a bale of hay, out here last night. And they ate it all up. But look, he's got that big old piece of snow on his hoof. That when he walks, it's going to come off. At least I hope so. Usually if I see that and I'm out there, see he don't like it. and It's uncomfortable. Um, usually I'll go out and I'll bang it off. But that should come off on its own. Come on, buddy. You take another step. Yeah, I know. You're tired. It's been a long night, I'm sure. You know, one more yawn for the YouTubies? <laughs> it's silent screams. <laughs> so, um... Morning, Jarvis. You been licking... Oh, you really, you too? Really, you guys? Go play somewhere else. So, they've been digging in the snow, and they've got their salt, and... Jarvis is pretty happy about it, and um, I've got two in there. I've got a mineral one and a, a white one, so they have a choice as to which one that they want to lick. And Jarvis usually chooses the mineral one over the white one, but this particular time he chose the white one. And he's got he's got snow boots too. <laughs> so uh, oh, maybe your boot fell off. Okay, so I am going to go get some alfalfa for these guys, so they get a little boost of warm stuff. Really, Eeyore? Eeyore, what are you doing? This is my rescue dog. He uh, he was a feral dog. The uh, I used to do a lot of um, volunteer work with my husband at the Gaston County Animal Control. And uh, we were dropping off some donations for them one year. And um, the director came out and said uh, that I had to go look at this dog that was in one of the kennels. And... Um, there was this little itty bitty little puppy looking like he was sitting like Eeyore <laughs> in the corner. And uh, long story short, he he was really super sick. He had Rocky Mounted Spotted Fever. <clears throat> and he's fine now. He's just a dorky old dog. Right? Are you a dorky dog? Yes, you are. Everybody loves you because you're so handsome. We had him DNA tested. And he likes Jack. And... um he is, uh, what is he, Australian Shepherd Boxer, Golden Retriever, Yellow Lab, Chow Chow. <laughs> so, is that good stuff, buddy? Blah, 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 with your tongue. So, I'm going to go this way and go get some alfalfa pellets and uh, go back inside and soak them up nice. And I'm going to grab a flake of alfalfa and uh, another half a bale of hay and throw that out there and I'll break it all up and that way they've got something to munch on while I'm soaking their food and um, whoo it's just cold <laughs> yes I know 
it's just cold. I wouldn't want to be out here. And I'm, I've got my pajamas, my cowboy boots, and you guys stay there. That's Lexi. Oh, well, looks like they've been up here. <laughs> Let's see what's in here. Let's see if they've been eating the hay that I've got hanging in here. Oh, they were in here last night. Uh, not really. It's nice and dry in here, so they they have a choice to come in. But I've been picking at it. Hi, Jack. I don't have any food yet. No, it's not not yet. I'm getting there though. Hi. Hi, Jarvis. Do you have one on your your feet? No. See, he's got a lot of snow on him. I like to see that. And he's not shivering, so he's not cold. I don't like him being wet, but I'd be more worried if he was wet and there would be no snow. Because, um, oh, don't stand behind him. He's going to kick you. Look, he's got his leg cocked. No, he just stopped. <laughs> but he's got little dingleberry snows <laughs> on his coat. That's stuck on there good. There you go, dude. So, he's warm. He's got a nice little blanket. His coat has laid down like it's supposed to, but if you look underneath, that's all dry. All under there, that's dry. So I'm not going to mess with that. And he's got a nice layer of heat in there, so it's keeping him warm. And they probably won't come in here because it'll melt. And then he'll they'll get wet. So look, this is perfect to show you his coat and how he fluffs it up. But all right, buddy, look at you. You're so handsome. All your snow. Oops, sorry. That was actually a pretty decent picture. Anyway, um, I'm gonna pause this. I'm gonna go and what are you eating in there? And uh, get some stuff for them. So I'll be back. All right. So this is what I've done. I've got half a bale of hay. This is my way of trying to uh, keep them out of the cold and the weather without really affecting them too much by putting blankets on and so forth. So um, I put in, uh, I think there's like two flakes of hay there. I always break it up because that's what you should do. You should always break it up because you never know what's in the, the bales. These bales are super loose bales. Um, which kind of makes me a little upset, but um, I top dressed it with alfalfa and that's what Jack's at right now. You can see the, the color differences, the alfalfa there and the hay is there. Normally I mix it in, but because it's on the wood chips, um, I'm not going to do that. I'll just leave it on the top and then they can dig down into it. So I'd like to eventually get put in some raised feeders so they're not eating off of the wood chips. Although... They don't seem to mind too much about digging through it. Um, they do all the time. So I'm sure it's not that great, but hey, I've seen Jack eating trees, so they haven't gotten sick, and I see little pieces of it in the bottom of their water sometimes. But <clears throat> this is my way of keeping them out of the weather without keeping them out of the weather. And they have a choice. They can stand with their butts that way if they like with their heads in here they can stand with their heads in here looking out that way but they choose to stand this way so jack can see out in the woods there he can see out into the pasture over there make sure no predators come to get them and they've got eyes all around so um horses are just awesome creatures and i don't know why people are so mean to them oh, it looks like jack found a big piece that i forgot to break up yep he did <laughs> I do break up the alfalfa a lot because it's hard and compact and square and dry. So I don't want them to take big, huge chunks. But sometimes the, the flowery parts on the alfalfa get um, really compact. Like Jar Jarvis there, he's got um, some of the, the weedy parts. And uh, the flowery parts turn to like powder pretty much when you break them up because they're so dry and compact. But there are the boys, and they're doing their, their thing, like they're supposed to. And uh, I'll just climb underneath Jarvis's belly, and I'll get out. Because <laughs> they make a pretty good wall. <laughs> but 
All right, guys. Well, uh, enjoy your day. I think I might. Yeah, I think I'm gonna take you guys out to to get the uh, trail cams and see if see what these guys do. They might follow. Nope, I lied. I went in. Right? Yeah.